everyone welcome back i am here i have been mia and um i've just had so many family events and commitments and um haven't been able to come on and say hello to my youtube uh crafty friends hello everyone hope everyone is doing well and today i'm opening some in love arts dies i want to show you what they sent to me so i could play with i hope you guys could go check them out I will list every single die down below in the description box. So go and check them out. Also, I do have a discount code and um, it's Eat Arrow 25. So guys, go check them out. They have so many beautiful dies. And so this first one here is called Birthday. And it's just a little simple background die with a little script. And it's a little fun script. So it's about, let me measure it for you. This is, I love having these small uh, dies sentiment dies because I could always put them on a small tag or a small embellishment um, This one measures about two and three quarters uh, By one inch. So this is pretty cute and I can't wait to cut into that one and I also have this one this one is called the butterfly border uh, die and look how cute it is. This one is just fabulous. I, I It cuts it all out so you we could always use this as a background piece or a uh or individual you could always cut them out individually but this one uh, goes on top of the card and it just makes this beautiful cluster of butterflies um and they're all um they're all connected just can't wait to play with this die let me go ahead and measure it for you it is about uh five and three quarters and at the top of the die or from the butterfly it's about two and a half so it's a pretty big size um, die for uh, your A2 size cards, and it'll be perfect. So I'm um, put these on the side so I can show you the next one. And then this one here is called the Bubble Love Background. And this one is so cute. Um, I am thinking of making this either a shaker because you know I love me some shakers. And of course, you know, I just can't have enough hearts in my stash. So I'm always looking for a heart. It doesn't cut out the border, but it does. You can um, cut out any any tag and then just uh, leave this uh, background or this leave this design on your on your project. So I can't wait to use this. And um, this one here is so super cute. I'm loving this one. And this one is the mailbox. And it has these tiny guys it has these tiny, tiny little envelopes. <laughs> How cute. And, um, of course we could always make these into like 3d projects. I love when a die, we could reuse it. So one of these small little envelopes is one inch and, um, the rest are about probably three quarters of an inch. This little teeny one is yeah, around like three quarters of an inch. So the mailbox itself measures about two by two and a half. So it has little feet that you could uh, place on the bottom and then it cuts out this little window and we could uh, put some um, ephemera uh, or make it a shaker. It's just the possibilities are endless and this is too cute. Um, let me show you the next one. And this one is of course a mason jar. I'm ready for summer. And um, this one is called um, lemon juice bottle. And it does have this tiny little lemon juice piece here where you can cut it out. So this one is one, uh, one inch and the uh, mason jar here is about three and across it is about two and a half. And then of course it has a straw and it has um, half of a, a slice of lemon. And then it has like the whole round piece of lemon and it has that little tiny tag here, which is about, about one and one quarter. So it's too cute. Um, I'm always loving the small dies in my sash. I know that uh, paper piecing is um, not for everyone, but for me, <laughs> I love how I could um, grab this and just add it onto another project. It doesn't have to be this mason jar, but these uh, pieces are uh, perfectly made for the size of the project or the mason jar here. So let me show you the next one. I think this one's my favorite because I am right now working on some uh working on a b project and i am gonna use this with some b paper that i purchased from scrapbook.com so this one is so super super cute and adorable and this one's called the wavy line frame again i am gonna link every single die below so you guys could go and snatch it for your stash and this one is so cute because um i am gonna show you the next one. Oh well first let me measure it guys 
I'm so excited because I can't wait to play with it. <laughs> I've been so busy lately that I haven't had time, but now I'm, I'm back and I am going to start crafting. So this one is five and a half by uh, close to four. And this whole uh, die. So it does cut out the circle or the, it does cut out the swirls here. So we could uh, cut this out in gold or cut it out in glitter and then put this background a different color. It's just, we could do so much. And the next one, which I, the reason why I got this die is because I got these cuties here. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. And this one is a, a bee and flowers because it does have a little flower here and the bees are just like one and one quarter by like one and one quarter, one and one quarter. <laughs> these are so adorable guys. I don't know if you guys can see the little eyes and um, they're just the cutest little faces. And so I am going to pair this die with this one because you know how a bee, it kind of swirls when it flies and it, it will, you know, usually it leaves like a little pattern. So I want to put a whole bunch of bees on this one and possibly this will be a shaker. I don't know because I don't have my ideas yet, but I do want to make this a shaker with my bee collection that I got from scrapbook.com. Also in love arts shop did send me a free gift and it's this a uh, little cute stamp set it has a flamingo it has a little bird here uh, a little alligator and butterflies and um this little friend here that has a little <laughs> i think it's a little monkey and then um and the lion so these are so cute to color and to make little cards or little tags and little birthday cards so guys this is all the dies that i will be uh playing with Please stay tuned for the project shares of these dies. Thank you. Thank you so much in love art shop for sending me these items so I can make projects with and you have an awesome day and I will talk to you on the next video. Bye.